How does China's newly revealed airborne police 700 AWACS break through technological boundaries to become a strategic pivot in the Western Pacific airspace? When this equipment, known as the Pacifier Early Warning Aircraft, was first captured by satellite deployment at the airport on Yongshu Island in the South China Sea, the military chess projection model updated overnight by Western think tanks exposed its core anxiety, this dual-band radar, full-area electronic reconnaissance and multispectral detection, are all part of the airborne fortress that is restructuring the rules of modern air warfare. The airborne fortress, which combines dual-band radar, full-area electronic reconnaissance and multispectrum detection, is reconfiguring the rules and regulations of modern air warfare. From the nose of the infrared imaging probe with a diameter of 1 meter to the wind of quantum communication pods, from the gallium nitride phased array module to the eye-assisted decision-making center, every technical detail of the Air Marshal 700 implies a targeted crack of the U.S. military's distributed kill chain. The most significant innovation of Air Marshal 700 is its triple perception architecture, the top dual-band active phased array radar adopts gallium nitride components, triple the power density compared to the Air Marshal 500, and the detection range of the F-35 exceeds 550 kilometers. The infrared optical electronic probe under the nose integrates a 640 times 512 pixel long wave infrared focal plane array. The integrated infrared electro-optical probe under the nose integrates a 640 times 512 pixel long wave infrared focal plane array, which can capture the thermal characteristics of the B-21 bomber's engine wake flow from 300 kilometers away, and the conformal antenna rays on the two sides of the tail realize the full band coverage from 0.1 to 40 GHz, which can analyze the frequency hopping pattern of the E2D AWACS's Link 16 data link in real time. This multispectrum fusion technology enables the Air Alert 700 to successfully penetrate the strong electromagnetic interference environment and guide the J-35 to carry out a blind raid on the simulated F-35 formation in the 2024 South China Sea joint exercise, verifying its anti-stealth, anti-interference and precision guidance, triple play capability. It verified its anti-stealth, anti-jamming and precision guidance capability. Compared with the active main force of the Airborne Police 500, the radar system of Airborne Police 700 has been upgraded from a three-sided array to a two-sided array design, and through the hybrid mode of mechanical rotation and electronic scanning, the refreshing rate has been increased to the 0.1 second level, and it can track 500 targets at the same time and implement continuous trajectory prediction for hypersonic missiles. Its L-band radar on the destroyer detection distance of 350 kilometers. S-Band is specializing in stealth targets. Through polarization coding technology to break the F-35 stealth coding resonance effect so that the U.S. military proud of the penetrating air control strategy faces the risk of failure. The U.S. Air Force simulation shows that the J-20 fleet guided by the Air Marshal 700 in the East China Sea Air Defense Identification Zone of the F-35 intercept success rate jumped from 68% in the Air Marshal 500 era to 92%. Despite using the same airframe as the Yun-9, the Air Marshal 700 has achieved a leap in performance through structural optimization, the cancellation of the traditional blade antenna reduces aerodynamic drag by 18%, and with the increase in power of the turbine 6C engine. The endurance has been extended to 12 hours. The 384 distributed or F apertures buried under the skin of the fuselage not only assume the function of electronic reconnaissance, but also form an adaptive sensing grid with the J-20's airborne radar. Adaptive sensing grid. In the confrontation exercise in the East China Sea Air Defense Identification Zone, the network has realized the threat ranking of 20 stealth targets within 0.8 seconds. It is worth noting that its mission system adopts open architecture and can dynamically load new algorithms through hardware-defined radio technology. In the Russia-Ukraine conflict, the system completed the Starlink satellite communication feature reversal in just 72 hours. In the Russian-Ukrainian conflict, the system completed the reverse analysis of the characteristics of satellite communications in only 72 hours providing key parameters for subsequent electronic countermeasures. The lessons learned from the downing of the Russian A-50 AWACS in Ukraine have given rise to the Air Marshal 700's three-dimensional defense system. The onboard laser warning system automatically releases nanofoil, infrared dual-mode jamming bombs, when missiles are approaching. The directional energy self-defense device at the root of the wing is capable of carrying out a soft kill of incoming missiles, within a distance of 10 kilometers and the anti-jamming data chain based on quantum key distribution 
ensures the stability of the command link in GPS-denied environments. The anti-jamming data link based on quantum key distribution ensures that the command link can still be maintained stable in a GPS denial environment. It was this system that enabled the Air Marshal 700 to maintain real-time situational sharing with the Shandong fleet via the Baidu II satellite during the Taiwan Strait crisis in December 2024 when it was subjected to an electronic attack by the AN. A LQ-249, the U.S. Center for Naval Analyses report pointed out that the Airborne Police 700 battlefield survival rate than the previous generation to enhance the 300 percent, its perception, decision-making, counterattack, closed-loop time compression to 4.7 seconds, has reached the U.S. Military E7 a plan to achieve the level of 2030. As the core note of Kill Chain 2.0, Air Marshal 700, realizes three levels of system integration at the tactical level, its L-band radar can provide mid-range correction for the Eagle 21 anti-ship ballistic missile of the 055-type destroyer so that the round probability error of the missile with a range of 1,200 kilometers has been reduced from 30 meters to 8 meters at the battle level. It can provide mid-range correction for the Eagle 21 anti-ship ballistic missile of the 055-type destroyer through space-based infrared system and road-based infrared system. Through the data fusion of space-based infrared system, and road-based meter wave radar. It builds a two-layer early warning network for hypersonic weapons, which can continuously track the target at Mach 6 at the strategic level. It forms a high and low collocation with the Airborne Police 3000. The former is responsible for strategic early warning at the level of 3000 kilometers, while the latter is responsible for strategic early warning at the level of 3000 kilometers. At the strategic level, it forms a high-low mix with the Airborne Police 3000. The former is responsible for strategic early warning at the 3,000 km level, while the latter focuses on tactical guidance within 800 km. This structure showed its power in a joint anti-submarine exercise. In early 2025, the Air Marshal 700 detected and continuously tracked a Kanglong-class submarine in the South China Sea for 47 hours by correlating magnetic anomaly detection with radar echoes setting a new non-acoustic anti-submarine record. The real subversiveness of Air Marshal 700 lies in its cloud-end computing architecture. The onboard I system can process 2,000 target tracks in parallel and dynamically optimize the allocation of sensor resources through reinforcement learning. In the simulated confrontation, the system has commanded 48 attack 11 UAVs to carry out multi-wave saturation attacks and its decision-making efficiency is six times higher than that of traditional manual command. The reserved quantum radar interface, on the other hand, lays the groundwork for the quantum entangled state detection module that is scheduled to be dressed up in 2028. The technology theoretically enables the detection range of stealthy targets to exceed 1,200 kilometers and identifies molecular vibration signatures of coded materials. What is more noteworthy is that its open mission system has reserved the swarm command protocol. The future can synchronize the control of more than 200 suicide drones to carry out distributed strikes. This AWACS is the battlefield cloud form or will completely subvert the manned, unmanned the traditional paradigm of manned, unmanned coordinated operations will be completely overturned. While the U.S. military is still debating the location of the production line for the E-7 AWACS, China has already completed a three-stage jump in AWACS technology with the Airborne Alert 700. From the blue waves of the South China Sea to the deep blue of the Western Pacific Ocean, this equipment not only means the existing stealth weapons system of the downward strike, but also heralds the future form of war to the intelligent ubiquitous perception of the profound transformation. Its radar beam woven invisible sky net is quietly reshaping the strategic balance of the Indo-Pacific region and the balance of history. May have been in this round of technological revolution, tilted toward the east, 